Hey guys, the same scene as yesterday, but uh, a, a bit of a different tip. So what we're going to be doing in here is uh, dealing with name tags for inserts uh, that come with Hardops inserts created by MasterZ on 1001. And if you want to get these, uh, these they are free uh, on Gumroad and Blender Market Store. So go through the links in the video description and check out Master Z on 1001 store. These are inserts for Keytops. And Keytops also links in the video description. Amazing add-on. You can get it for free and check it out. So go ahead and have fun. Anyway, so what I want to do is uh, grab this piece, right? And go to Q. Now for this to work, you do need Keytops installed and you do need uh, Hardops, okay? Because I'm going through Hardops menu and uh, just easier for me. So Alt click on this. Go here and inserts, and we're gonna grab uh, some like that. And uh, well, I cannot do it in local mode, so let's do it again. And add insert, and I'm gonna add it in here. And you can see that um, the insert that's been added to the scene has a name tag, and it's freaking annoying. So uh, let's just remove the materials very quickly. So you can see that there's a name tag uh, added to this insert. And you know, if you duplicate it, you're gonna get two names, which is bloody irritating. It's cluttering the scene. So to remove it, you need to go to object properties, right? And go to uh, visibility. And here under viewport visibility, just click on name and you know, you're done. So if you do it for the first one, if you duplicate it, you know, it's going to disappear, right? So that's how you remove this name tag uh, from objects and especially from these uh, hardops inserts. Anyway, guys, that's it for the video. If you do need hardops, box cutter, and kitops, etc., go through the links in video description. Thanks for watching. Catch you next one.